Today we will be showing how math is used in the everyday world and for your basic needs. As you can tell, pyramids didn't just fall from the sky, they were actually constructed using maths, seeing as maths can be as simple as 1 plus 1 to being as complicated or as complex as a theorem, Pythagoras theorem. Pyramids are one of the oldest standing man-made buildings today that hasn't been rebuilt. Pythagoras was invented by a man called Pythagoras, and he was around from C500 BC to C580 BC, and his technique is still used in the modern world today, and little did he know that 1,438 years later we would be studying him. In his lifetime, Pythagoras went to Egypt, and during his journey he noticed and explored the method and interesting strategy that Egyptians had to improve the stability of pyramid walls. They used a rope with 12 knots tied evenly spaced, which resulted in the famous 3, 4, five, and 5 triangle, forming a 90 degree angle. Knotted ropes like this were used to ensure that the corners in the base of the pyramid were all right angles. Pythagoras is simply a squared plus b squared equals c squared, and is worked out if the hypotenuse is the value of the sum of the square of the two other lengths. For example, if a triangle has lengths of 3, 4, and 5, that means it is a right angle triangle plus, because 3 squared equals 9, 4 squared equals 16, and 5 squared equals 25. So when you add 9 to 16, it equals 25. Therefore, 5 is the hypotenuse. Go. Modern day builders still use the Pythagorean theorem with the same motive, which is to ensure that their buildings are square. However, they are not used to construct pyramid due to how reliant we have become on technology. So maths is the reason why you have a shelter above your head. Thank the Lord and thank maths.